Well, Wilco, 150 A-League wins in the bag. How does it feel? Yeah, look, it's a, it's a nice thing to, to look back on, I suppose. And it just, I guess I've like, been lucky enough to be a part of um, some good teams over the years, which have been able to get a few wins. And, you know, none more so than Sydney over the last um, four or five seasons, which we've had some great success. So hopefully there's a few more to come. So what do you put that success down to? Um, I've, look, I think especially at Sydney is, um, you know, keeping the core group of um, quality players together. Um, you know, the culture we've created here is a really good one. And we've managed to, to keep a lot of players um, here over a consistent period of time, which I think helps with um, you know the way the team plays, um, but also, as I said, the culture and the fact that we, we not only bring good players in, but good people, and, and everyone gets on really well, and I think that all sort of bodes well for a successful team. So you're here in season one, you were here in season 15 as well now, uh, taking grand finals out of the equation, uh, what are the most memorable games for yourself? Yeah, look, I think, um, I don't know, it's hard to remember the early days, it was a while ago now, but look, um, you know, we had some great wins with the Mariners in front of some, um, you know, full, full houses up there at Gosford. You know, when, when that stadium's full, it can really rock. And in the, in the first few seasons there, when, when the team was, was doing really well, we had some great nights there. And, and obviously with Sydney, um, you know, there's been a lot of memorable moments over the last four or five years. Some great wins in the derbies um, against big crowds, some great wins against Melbourne Victory, um, who are, you know, traditional rivals for us. So none really stand out more so than others, but, um, you know, just, I guess, lucky to have been able to be part of um, some successful teams. Is it the, uh, the same sense of emotion, same jubilation you get uh, from win one to win 150? Is there any difference in terms of when you get the three points in the bag? No, I, I don't think so. I mean, I think, um, you know, winning's winning and, and that's why we, we play the sport. You know, we're competitive, um, you know, and we train all week for that 90 minutes on the weekend and, you know, to win that you know, a game each week makes the makes everything worthwhile, and it's what you play the game for. So it's much similar, but obviously, um, you know, I think as you get older, you, you you probably enjoy it a little bit more when you realise. And when you're young, you're a little bit naive and, and can take things for granted, I suppose. And but when you can be part of a successful team when you're a little bit older, I think you you treasure it a little bit more. You got win 151 on the cards on Monday night against Wellington. What are you expecting against them on Monday night? Yeah, tough game, I think. Um, you know, Wellington showed in the first game that they're a good team. They, they had a great year last year. Um, you know, Uffie's got them playing really well. So um, they picked up a win against the Mariners a couple of nights ago. So um, they're going to be tough. But as you said, we, we got a win against them first, first game of the season. We played really well in the first half there, created quite a few chances. I think the second half we um, dropped off a little bit. So that's been improving every week since. And, um, you know, I thought the performance against MacArthur was good. It was great to score some goals and get, get the confidence up. And, you know, we'll keep that rolling into Wellington. Yeah, how much does that win over MacArthur buoy the squad leading into this one on Monday night? Obviously, the, the result against the Mariners wasn't great, but, you know, after looking back at it and watching the video, there were, there were a lot of parts in that game that we did quite well. We just, you know, were a little bit sloppy, letting two soft goals in, and also probably needed to be a little bit more ruthless in, in scoring our chances. So we managed to do that against MacArthur, which was good, and as I mentioned, get the confidence up and um, keep rolling from now. Just the last one, obviously. Uh, how much do you enjoy playing down at uh, Nestrata Jubilee Stadium in Cogra there? Yeah, look, uh, Cogra's fantastic. You know, I love the community grounds. I think with, with obviously Allianz out of action, it's given us a, a great chance to, to play at some community grounds like Cogra, like Leichhardt. Um, and our, our record at Cogra's been fantastic. You know, we've, we've played a lot of games there now and, and, and managed to get a lot of wins. So it'd be nice to get back there on Monday and, and hopefully we can get a, a good-sized crowd out there to support us.